Hello everybody, this is Big Joe with Big Joe Mobile Reviews. Now today, I'll show you guys how to hard reset your Samsung Prevail. Now this one's from Metro PCS, so it comes in white. There's also a red and a black variation of the exact same phone. Let's say, you know, you let your kid use your phone and they're constantly going through your passcode and, you know, they suddenly lock your phone out. Now, kind of go into panic. Oh my gosh, what am I supposed to do? Well, I got a solution for you. Um, the first thing that you want to do is go ahead and remove your back and your battery. So, I'm going to put that to the side. Now, doing this hard reset, uh, it's going to erase all your personal information off the phone. It's going to remove your passcode. It's going to erase any contacts, pictures, messages. Please be aware of that. And also, any Gmail account associated with the with the phone. Uh, this is also a great thing to do if you plan on selling your phone, plan on upgrading, don't want nobody to get a hold of your personal information. This is a great way. Uh, this is actually a great process. So, like I said, I removed the battery and I removed the back. Uh, say about 10 seconds. I'm gonna go ahead and put it back together. Now, what I want you to do is make sure you got at least 20% battery life, and. Um, Look for your volume rocker. That's your volume up and down keys right there on the side. And you've got your um, your back key here on the front. What I want you to do is press and hold volume, press and hold volume down, back, and hold, and then power all at the same time. I want you to do this for about 10 seconds or so. I'm going to go ahead and count out loud so you can count with me. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 9, 10. Now, I can go ahead and let go, and voila, Android system recovery menu. Now, here we can do all kinds of things. Update the phone, uh, apply an update uh, from an SD card, uh, wipe the cache on the phone, but we want to go ahead and wipe the whole phone out. Do a factory reset. You're going to use your volume up and down again to go down to fa wipe data, factory reset. We're going to use our power button to select that. Oh no excuse me, our home button. Now, we're going to use our volume down, up and down again to go down to yes, delete all user data. We're going to use our home button to select that. And it just wiped out our whole phone. Now, we're back to the original menu of the Android recovery uh, screen. Uh, we're going to go ahead and press the home button to select reboot system now. It should default uh, beyond that, so uh, no need to move anywhere. So we're going to go ahead and press home again. And now we're going to wait about 30 seconds, maybe a minute and a half um, for the phone to completely reset. Now, I recommend removing the SD card if you have any personal information on it. Uh, you know, a lot of people have you know their music, pictures, videos uh, stored on their SD cards, and I don't want you to lose that. So make sure you always, uh, you always remove it before doing something like this. I already have mine removed. So I'm going to go ahead and let it sit, and I'm going to show you at the end of the video. I how the phone got completely restored back to factory. Now, like I said, this takes usually about, you know, say a minute to a minute and a half. Um, this process works 99% of the time. Now, if you run into a problem where the phone does not come back on, it stays on the Samsung logo for a very long time, just go through the first steps that we showed you on the video, and uh, your phone should work. Um, Alright, the phone's coming back on. Give it a second. Uh -huh. 
And there we go. No passcode. Look at that. Awesome. See that? Amazing. Hey, thanks for watching my video. Please don't forget to subscribe. If you have any questions or if you have any you know, suggestions on another video, please leave them in the comment section below. And uh, have a good day.